If you are like most of my students, your lives are full to the brim with responsibilities. Work, home, other school-related duties, personal relationships, children, and maybe even a second or third job. Online courses can be a solution to getting that degree while still maintaining some semblance of life. I have a very good idea of how hard it is to work and go to school. So I am not a teacher who is going to drop any pop quizzes or gotcha assignments on you. I want you to succeed because I really think there need to be better thinkers in the world. I don't know about you, but people yelling at each other on TV is not my idea of how to solve the big problems. And this course is about thinking about the big problems. Notice that no big answers are promised. At the end of this course, you will have a very good method for addressing pretty much any big idea with some confidence that you're going about it in a way that will ensure you are not yelling at someone instead of thinking things through. I think that alone is a good reason to take the course. My students have developed all sorts of workarounds to make this course work for them, including, but not limited to, bringing their paradoxes and big ideas and their critical thought of the week and or their readings to their friends, spouses, and even their children. In one class, a single father with three children under 10, imagine that, had daily discussions with his kids about Plato's ideas while he organized their school lunch boxes. His sharing of his children's comments with the class were one of the highlights of my experience of teaching critical thoughts. For example, one of his children, three years old, said that Plato could not be a very important person. Why? Because he has a stupid name, Dad. Uh, Play-Doh? <laughs> I have even had couples take a course, discuss the ideas between themselves, and use those discussions in their varying assignments. Sorry, you cannot let your spouse or your significant other do your work for you, but it was a lot of fun. Because I have been teaching online full-time for a long time, 15 years, to thousands of hardworking students who have come from practically every possible background, including students living in their cars, students under fire in Iraq, students living in about 50 different countries, and students of all ages, I have made all the elements of the course fit into a time period that is doable in between doing other things. Note, I give approximate time it takes to do each activity right under that activity. So you can get a piece of the course done, say, while waiting to pick up the kids, or while standing in line at the grocery store, if you have printed out a reading, or if you have a smartphone. Speaking of which, please do not try to go to school online on an iPad. You will be seriously frustrated. An iPhone should work just fine. Obviously, a laptop is ideal. Think about it. An online class is well online. And so what you could get in the what you might be able to get by with in the classroom might not work out very well online. Antioch provides a list of what works best. If you want to know my own setup, I have a Mac and a PC so I can test all my work to make sure it works on every kind of computer and an iPhone 6, yes, the big one, and I'm discovering I tend to spend much more time on my iPhone than I ever thought I would. And I've been testing to see if you can do the work on that phone, and so far, so good. So to repeat, Antioch gives a list of what will work for you, and just so you know, many of my students have taken this course at Starbucks because they do not have Wi-Fi. <laughs> The first week of this course is fun and games. These games are mainly to teach students who have no experience with technology how to use what is available to them. So if you're already tech savvy, you can skip them and go right into the first critical thought. If you are not tech savvy, don't worry. 
I'm going to teach you how to use elements of the internet that will also help you in real life. Sakai is great, but I want my students to learn technology that they can use when they graduate. Note that all of the modules are open, all of them. They are open so that if you know you will have to go on a business trip or vacation or you know something else is coming up, you can plan accordingly and work ahead. Obviously, you'll have to drop back in for the discussions, but I've been almost all around the world, and so far at least, there's been nowhere that did not have an internet connection, even though it did cost 25 cents a minute in Moscow. <laughs> the final project is due two weeks before the end of classes, so that it is easily possible to finish this course before you have to take finals or complete projects in other courses. This is a course that is designed to work around you. My best advice for all students, even if you're only going to college and have a trust fund supporting you, <laughs> my best advice is to always be at least one week ahead. Two weeks if you possibly can fit it in. Why? Because as they say, life has a knack of getting in the way and online courses can get away from you fast because there is no one pestering you to hand in your work. I guess you could say this is the grown-ups table in that regard. But I built the course around you and even built in some natural extensions, as you'll see as you go forward. But I can't give actual extensions on anything, mainly because this entire course is discussion driven. And it's impossible to have a discussion later. You need the rest of the class to have a discussion with. So if you get slammed for time and you want to be sure to keep up, go to discussions. If you want to know more, you can email me anytime. I could share the thousands of student reviews of this course, but suffice it to say that almost all critical thought students say they have a good time while learning a great deal about thinking for themselves. Many become friends and continue having their discussions long after the course is over. I hope you will learn a lot and have fun and friendship along the way.